All right, guys, what's going on today? Um, so when I was at Target the other day, <clears throat> I picked up those uh, Legendary Duelist Season 3 boxes. I also found some Pokemon. The Sword and Shield Lost Origin. I believe that set just came out, and I haven't been able to get any yet. So I went ahead and bought five packs of them. That way we can... Uh, you know, go ahead and open some other stuff other than Yu-Gi-Oh! on the channel. Because I do collect some Pokemon cards and stuff. I'm just not as big into Pokemon as I am into Yu-Gi-Oh! So, I have a couple other videos coming out. Uh, some sports cards, ones, two, later on. And uh, some other Yu-Gi-Oh! surprises um, coming up very shortly. So, make sure you guys stay tuned, like, and be subscribed to the channel. And turn on those notifications. So, we will be getting right into this opening... I want to open these without destroying um, the pack and the cards. Obviously, they make these things super, super hard to... Uh, so, Sword and Shield Lost Origin expansion contains over 190 cards. Each Pokemon TCG Sword and Shield Lost Origin booster pack contains 10 cards and either one basic entry or one V-Star marker. Each player must have a 60-card deck of Pokemon cards to play. And that's it. I don't think I've ever played Pokemon the card game. I don't even know, understand or how it works or anything. So um, let's go ahead and just open up these all like right away. I don't know the best way to open these, but we're going to find out. Um, these all seem super, super hard to open, I guess. So I'm just going to rip them apart without damaging too much, I guess, <clears throat> and see what happens. There we go, that's the way to do it. You can just pull it right out. Okay. So now I'm getting the hang of this. See, Yu-Gi-Oh! boosters are feeling like a little bit way easier than this to open. Because now I'm struggling. And you guys are probably laughing at me. Alright. Can you just pull that out? Thank you. Thank you. And thank you. Alright. Oh. See? Messed it up there too. Pulled it out. Got it. Got it, we're good. All right. So we got five packs of 10 cards of Pokemon Sword and Shield Lost Origin. So let's see what we can get. A little bit more difficult to open than Yu-Gi-Oh! packs too. So, all right. I don't wanna spoil anything for you guys. So this is the code. <clears throat> We have Electric, we have Ghastly, Bionicle, Murkrow, Wurmple, we got a Rhyhorn, Shiny, we have a uh, Trevenant, looks like a secret rare or something, I forget the rare, he's in uh, Pokemon, <clears throat> but yeah, I forget what the rarities are, I know we want like V-Star Maxes and V-Star cards, I know that much, but when it comes to rarities i know there's like alternate arts and whatnot um it's been a while since i've opened any pokemon product i think like the last pokemon product i opened was brilliant stars and that was months and months and months ago when it first came out i had a pre-order in for two boxes uh we have growl we have ducklet well i think that actually looks like a real duck that's kind of creepy uh rock rough we have seal we have hyusin zura we have Radiant Gardevoir. Oh, nice. Look at that card, huh? That's a cool looking card. Electros. We have Energy. Cascoon. And, yeah. That's about it. I think the basic energy cards, I don't know. I don't know if the basic energy cards are even really, really worth anything. or They're just in there. But, who knows. I'm going to have to do some research after this. Oh my gosh. This is not opening well. See, this is what I say. Like, Pokemon cards are so much harder to open than Yu-Gi-Oh packs are. You need, like, fingernails to do it. I don't have fingernails. All right, we're just going to go ahead with the knife without damaging anything. Run that up there. That worked out perfect. Way easier. So we have Snover. We have Machop. We have a Pikachu. 
We have a Jinx. We have a Litwick. We have a Stung Fish. It looks like a Hollow. We have Comfy. We have an Energy. Damage Pipe. And a Surviper. I don't know if this Surviper is supposed to look like that or if it's alternate art or something, but I don't know. We got one Hollow out of that pack. That's interesting. <clears throat> but we also got the energy, so I don't know if the energy is basic or what goes on with that. I'm gonna have to, like I said, I'm gonna have to do some research into this set after we get done with this opening and you know see what cards are worth and everything like that. I have a bunch of Yu-Gi-Oh cards coming back from PSA soon. I also threw in like ten, uh, ten Pokemon cards that we got from Brilliant Stars opening too. So I'm pretty excited for that to come back. <clears throat> that should be coming back in about a month or so. So we have Pikachu, we have Jinx, we have Litwick, we have Oddish, we have Love Disc, ooh, we have Mian Fu, the Kung Fu, whatever that is, Clefable, we have Basic Energy, and an Arc Phone, and a Metacham. Oh, and Miss Fortune Sisters, Trainer. Not a hollow, though. I know in uh, Brilliant Stars, they had hollow trainers, and those were actually worth a little bit of money and stuff like that. So, like Marine's Pride and stuff like that and everything. I'm just going to cut this open because I'm not going to do this. All right, there we go. Hey, these are super sticky. Um, <clears throat> we have Metatite. We have Shellos, playing with a friend, apparently. We have Mian Fu. Lit Leo. We have Ghastly. We have Radiant Steelix. That's a super cool artwork again. So if we get two Radiant cards. So I think the Radiant cards are the ones that we're like looking for. Other than V-Stars. And then we have a V-Star. Just a V-Star card. And then a Silicone. Does that mean there's a V-Star in this pack? Me and Sho. We have a Trainer. And that. No. I don't know what that V-Star is. But uh. Yeah. I don't know. But I don't know why we just got a random V-Star card out of nowhere and stuff. So, I don't know. No idea, guys. But, uh, Lost Wars Unpack. You see, the some cards in either one base game or one V-Star Mario H points. Yeah, so, okay. So, that's going to do it for today's video, guys. And I hope you enjoyed it. We might do a little more Pokemon stuff later on or something but uh just leave a like subscribe to the channel i really appreciate you guys supporting me as far as this gun we're almost at 2,000 subscribers so please mash that subscribe button and i will see you all on the next one peace out